Hello YouTube, iPhone Rebel here with another exciting video. This time, we're out in the snow and we're using our Canon Rebel SL1. And I'm gonna bring out some smoke bombs and we're gonna play with that and see what kind of photos we can get. Trust me, snow photography and snow in general is fun. Don't believe me? I'll show you in just a second. See, it's a lot of fun. Now, don't forget to pull out your Canon Rebel and let's get shooting. So what we're gonna use in this photo is a smoke bomb. You can get these at Amazon or any firework place. And we're just gonna set it in the snow. We're gonna light it on fire and we're gonna take some photos. So as you can see, we're shooting directly into the sun, meaning the sun is right up there. And most photographers don't even like to shoot into the sun because it produces these lens flares that don't really look that great or they just want to re they don't even want to have lens flares they want to have a perfect crisp image but we're going to be shooting into the sun I'll show you it's going to produce some really cool effects so we set up our smoke bomb make sure that we get our matches out remember to be safe with fire I don't know why I said that but everyone says it so some simple settings that we're going to use make sure we turn it on and use our polarizer filter is we're going to select one over a thousand shutter speed. You're gonna see what that looks like. Go ahead and click right here for a video I made on how to use your histogram and metering systems to get the best possible image with the best lighting. So I see that has a pretty good image right now. I think I am going to start shooting. So I'm gonna light the smoke bomb, whatever. Take two. Light the smoke bomb. Go ahead and pull out your camera out. Start taking photos. And there you have it. So here's our photos that we took. As you can see, the smoke looks really cool. And because we shot into the sun, you're actually getting a really cool effect of how the smoke is coming up and the sun is actually lighting, backlighting that smoke. So you can see this was my test shot. Then I lit it and as it was lighting, the smoke was coming out. Started getting more, I switched angles. And I came out with some pretty cool stuff that you guys can try if you just get a smoke bomb and shoot in the snow. Oh, and uh, don't forget to use your 3D glasses like I showed in the other video. They actually do polarize the snow and make it so that the snow isn't as bright into your eyes. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. I'll see you next time on iPhone Rebel.